Good evening and welcome back to another challenge for GeoGuessers. Stop coughing, everybody. We are back with our time challenge posted to the subreddit for you guys to play along with us. Uh, so follow the link, record your scores via video, via screenshots, whatever you want to do it as, and then post them to the subreddit so we can see how you did, and then you can become the weekly champion. Uh, today we have myself, Modi Apparatus, and Alzarath. <coughs> Fixer. Goody gumdrops. And the Pastafarian. Greetings. And before we get into this week's challenge, we have to address the business of last week's challenge, which was a top score of 18,451 from... I don't know if I have the name here. User GeoGuessr Oh, user Reddit. GeoGuessr. GeoGuessr was the user. Okay, got it. Okay. A little confusing. <laughs> GeoGuessr got the score. Man, that's a tremendous score. Gotta, gotta, gotta give you props for that. Uh, honorable mention... To Nozzle the Clown with 17,571, and he said this is his first time doing the challenge with us, so thank you for joining us, and uh, that's a really good score. Any other week, that would definitely take it. And uh, also, honorable mention to Mr. Miyogi. 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 Uh, Miyogi. Miyogi. <laughs> uh, yeah. For 16,433, also a very good score. So, man, some really good scores here. We could not mash those. I'm just telling you guys right now, we're not getting any close. We're close to that. Uh, also, a special honorable mention to uh, Nora, who was the first video submission we had for the challenge, which is fantastic. So, thank you for doing the video. We appreciate that. And uh, thanks for playing along. It's been a lot of fun. Thanks, Nora. Thanks. Thank you. So, let's get into new business now. We got the two-minute time challenge. The seed is down below in the description if you want to play along. And then make sure, if you are going to post your score, capture screenshots or video or whatever, however you want to do it. Uh, everybody ready? Indeed. Uh -huh. Alright, let's get into it in three, two, one, go! Alright, welcome back. And this time I actually went ahead and um, changed my mumble settings uh, before actually uh, starting this video. Okay, people are driving on the right. Um, let's head down the street to see what we can find other than maybe the sun. Uh, the sun has to be here-ish. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Oh, the sun isn't very far here, so maybe we're a little bit south of the equator. Yeah, um, sorry Verta, you weren't uh, mentioned you you got a very nice score but uh, oh well um, we had so many uh, tremendous scores uh, above 15,000 I think we had eight people over 18,000 uh, um, over 10,000 points uh, which was just wow amazing um, but oh well things like these happen and um, let's see how we can do in this challenge um, yeah, I already said it, the sun is... Where, where was the sun? It has to be here-ish. Yeah. It, it was a bit... Uh, we're somewhere in the vicinity of the equator, is what I wanted to say. So maybe in South America? I don't know, though. Uh, uh, oh. Walking tall. Okay, we're, t we're in Tennessee. Where is Tennessee? There is Tennessee. Okay. Somewhere on the street. Okay. Um, okay, cool. Then let's make the guess and see. Yeah, we were in Tennessee. Good thing I found that after all. Okay, we were... I think B is... Well Alright, that's gonna do it for round one. Uh, I managed to find a sign that said uh, walking trail for Tennessee. Yeah, yeah, so I, I was in the right too. state, at least. And uh, I picked the eastern side, unfortunately, so my score was 2585. But uh, I'm happy with that. It's a pretty decent uh, pretty de decent take on it. Uh, fic or Pasta, you did the same thing, pretty much? Yeah, I uh, found the sign right at the end and put my thingy southeast of Nashville and got 2,769 points. Oh, when you get so close like that, the exponential points are kind of a... Yeah, it's like, you're just, kind you're of just a like, off. This is the west of me. And you got like 200 more points than I did, so that's yeah, that's something ridiculous. Uh, Fixer, how'd you do? Yep, I saw the same sign. I, I went way down the road, and I couldn't find any kind of road signs or anything. So I picked southwest as Nashville, and I got 3173. Seriously, nice. again, like just a few kilometers or whatever away, and you get another 300 points or so. Uh, uh, Elzrath, how'd you do? 
Uh, there was a mine was a Tennessee Department of Transportation sign, but I guessed kind of south of Knoxville and only got twenty five ten. And I thought it was okay. A good so you're guess. closer to me. Yeah. <laughs> what an amateur. <laughs> yeah. I was in Nashville originally, and I moved into the east, thinking it was closer to like the mountains. But it, it uh, seemed wrong. more like moist environment. So yeah, guessing a bit further east seemed smarter to me. Yeah. As you get drier, Whatever. as you move west. But anyway, pretty much even on round one here, I'd say. Uh, with the with the difference, maybe six hundred points total. So that's not too yeah. bad. All right, round two coming at you. One, three, two, one, go. All right, that was a nice start, wasn't it? And we got blurry photos again. So, two thousand thirteen Google uh, in the background. This this looks like South Africa or Australia to me. Oh, don't run down on me now. Uh, let's see if I can find something. The problem is Australia and South Africa are on the same latitude, so the sun trick won't really work. And I think there is nothing in the distance to give off what we got here. So let's get back uh, very fast. Feeling noxious again, uh, right now? Hopefully not. Okay, um... <laughs> oh man, there's nothing here. Oh. Is that some sort of... was that a sign? That indeed was a sign on the left side. We are somewhere in Australia, I guess. Okay, I think... Uh, somewhere in Western Australia, for now. Just for now. Um, okay, this... No junction, but we have a curve going on here. So let's see. Yeah, there is some sort of entry entryway. Maybe to a farm right in the outback. Oh man, right in the middle of nowhere. Uh, another sign. Yeah, same sign. Not really of much help. Uh, I, th I don't think there is something coming up right now. Nah, nope, not really. Oh, hey, there's another sign. What? Oh, roadway? Or what does it say? Oh well, let's make a guess. Ah, not too bad though. I was in the right, All right. state. Uh, that is round two. Not a lot to go on there. It just kind of looked yeah. like Australia to me. I was yep. like saying it didn't have anything to dis disprove that this wasn't South Africa, but uh, I went with just kind of this hedge my bets, center, center of Australia, a little bit to the western side because I figured it's a little more arid. And I uh, got 21-25 is my score here. Pasta, how do you do? Um, I guessed Australia as well. I found several signs on the left side of the road. And um, I picked somewhere in Western Australia and got 22-64 points. Very nice. Elzerath? I guessed dead center in Australia and got 19-68. So. Yep, got you just seemed Australia. Bets. Um, as far yeah. as the South Africa thing, actually, the quality of the camera, I have been told, will tell you the difference of Australia and uh, South Africa. Supposedly, South Africa has really good Google images. Uh, mm, good so. to know, good, good to, to know. know. <laughs> Fixer, similar, similar take on it? Yep, exactly. I went with Australia because of the quality of the images. Uh, I didn't see any signs, though, not a single sign. I just kept on going and going and going. Yeah. So I, I I picked Central Australia just a little to the west and got twenty eleven. Sounds like we have a very close match going on here. Yep. Let's see if around three can be the decider in three, two, one, go. Right. Um nice landscape. I like this and oh oh bummer. Okay, I think um, the American ones will have an advantage here um, because I don't know where this um, um, plate might be from. Um, I think we can be somewhere in... Okay, we got the lens glare from here. We are somewhere in the vicinity of the equator. Um, so not too far off, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Right in the middle. Yeah, maybe a bit north. Um. Oh well. 
Yeah, so I have no idea if that actually might be south of uh, North America. There is something in the back here. Um, unfortunately, I can't read the name. So, there isn't much to give away where we actually are. I would say somewhere in the vicinity of a desert. Uh, it's nice to have a Dodge Challenger here, but I can't really read that sign. So, ah, uh, where will... Hmm. Maybe Arizona? Ah, why not? I will pick Arizona for now. I might be totally wrong, uh, as per usual, when it comes to the US. Um, because I have no idea where this license plate is from. And um, this might spell Arizona, it might not. Anyways, I'm going for it. Ah, it, it was Arizona. Ha! Very good. Very good. I did not expect California. All right, uh, I went with uh, Idaho. Actually, didn't have much to go off of. I think you the license uh, plate... American guys had an advantage here because of the license plate. No, the no, license it, plate was for Illinois. I couldn't actually, tell what the license plate was. No, it was oh, it was Illinois license plate. Okay. And that was it was in California, so it didn't really make it. It didn't make a whole lot of difference, uh, as far as I could tell. It was either New York, or Illinois, as far as I know. Um, anyways, I went with Idaho. I got twenty one forty three. Uh, pasta, how'd you do? Um, I went with Arizona. Because it looked uh, southernish to me, the sun were standing right in the west, west. I guess, yeah. And um, I don't know, I couldn't <coughs> do anything with the license plate other than it was American to me. So, yeah, 2409 points. All right, not bad, not bad at all there. Uh, Elzrath, how'd you do? Um, I was hovering between New Mexico, West Texas, and Arizona. Um, you had limestone there, you had kite, which is that those mounds of rubble, uh, the little like dust looking stuff. Um, you had sandstone and stuff like that, which led me to believe it was the south. The vegetation is very West Texas through Arizona. Uh, as you go further north, you're going to run out of that kind of vegetation. Hmm. But I got 2308 because I guessed Eastern Arizona to try to hedge my bets over there. That did not look like California to me. It's usually a little bit more no. verdant in California. Yeah, and it's even like where where the marker is, it's very it's a green national park there. So it might I don't know if that green stuff matters. It's part no, signifying parks, but I don't know. Uh, Fixer, how'd you do? Yeah, that was a tough one. I, I zoomed into the plate and I didn't know it was Illinois, but. I could barely make out the state in the middle of the plate, and it looked like a tall, skinny state. I already put my marker down in, in New Mexico, but I, at the last second, I was thinking about Idaho. I stuck with New Mexico and got 2171. I should have listened to my gut. Yeah, I'm not I'm not convinced it was an Illinois plate, but I do think the Illinois plates kind of look like that with the blue on the bottom. Well, Illinois uh, and is state tall kind of and skinny. Behind. So, and it is, yeah, that works too. And so. so is Idaho and, of course, California. I don't know what the California plates look like, so that, that can get a frame of reference there. But uh, anyways, it didn't prove to be that much of an advantage for us, Pasta, anyways, so you're uh, yeah, on even playing field still. Pretty even even scores here so far. Yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah, really. It's going to be a really close interesting. one. Very so much far, so. I think I'm last still, though. <laughs> I don't know. You had one round where you're ahead, I think. So. Yep. Yeah. All right. Round four. Coming at you right now. Three, two, one, go. Well, we well, quite even. Okay, this looks like some sort of holiday resort, and we can't move anywhere. The sun is standing here, um, so it should be here, and yeah, so we are a bit north of the equator, I guess, but I have no idea where exactly we are. There are some sort of buildings, holiday resort, whatever. Um, the people are of dark skin color, um, which is quite interesting, so, um, ugh. <laughs> I have no idea where, what I should take from that. Um, we have nearly at 45 degree angle, so we are in the vicinity of Australia, South Africa, South America, or more, uh, Europe, yeah. I think, um... The equator is moving around um, the or Indonesia and Papua New Guinea, so it, it can't really be that. 
Might be Thailand, although I don't know. Um, nah, maybe uh, it has to be one of these states, I guess. Uh, let's go for South Africa and some sort of beach. Yeah, maybe somewhere here. That looks good. Wetland Park. Um, nice water though. Bit greenish though. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I think we can go with that and see where we actually are. Oh, it wasn't too bad. Oh, it was in Mozambique. Ah, cool. So, good thing I went for that. And, yeah, there there is this little bay we saw, so... Yeah, I was afraid that would happen. Ah. Oh, my God. This was the separator here. Now, we are no longer tied, guys. We are no longer <laughs> tied. Aww. Uh, I went with the Mexico and got 68 points. Ouch. So that's it. That's it. Anybody else have a reasonable guess? Yeah, I, Pasta? I have a reasonable guess. Um... Yeah, I did the sun trick, so it had to be quite south of the equator. Uh, so somewhere in the vicinity of South Africa, Australia, or South America. And I went with the east coast of South Africa, somewhere um, near Swaziland, and I have 2,605 points. Jeez, I thought the sun wow. was south. Uh, the, yeah, so did I. Yeah, the but sun it was, was south. morning. That's so. Yeah. I... Yeah, it's still north. Ah, interesting. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> the people in the water they had dark skin color. Oh, the image was the too blurry. Poor. People. I yeah, tell, I, yeah, there were four or six people, and they all had dark skin. So it had to be South Africa or somewhere at the coastline of uh, the south of the African continent. Props to you, Pass. That's a really excellent guess, man. I don't even know if I could have got it with the sun. Apparently, it's not quite right there, but um, uh, Fixer, how'd you do? Oh, that was definitely Rhode Island. I got 176. <laughs> Ouch. That's... Alzheimer's? I, I guessed along the Gulf of Mexico and got Oh, not alone, at least. See, I oh, think Pasta oh. may have won this one unless he wow. really botches the next guess. I was uh, going to yeah. guess Florida, Florida, but there were Might no happen. palm trees. No, those yeah. trees are weird. I wasn't sure what those were. Right, and there were no coniferous Maybe trees, so it trees? wasn't the far north. I yeah. know. It was a tough one for sure. Yeah, indeed. For yeah. sure. Pasta is a runaway trade now. we got to stop him somehow. Yay. Uh, let's go round five and see if he botches it. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. All right, I'm doing quite good, but knowing my luck, um, this will stop in a minute. All right, um, this looks nice. Um, sun is right here-ish. Ah, there it is. So it's in the middle. Oh, wow. It's way in the south, so we are way north. Um, or the north is in the south, so we are north. Um, yeah. So I guess we are somewhere in Scandinavia. Um, yeah, Verta, maybe you have a... Oh, yeah. This is definitely... This looks Finnish. Um, Verta, if you watched this video, this is definitely finished, right? And if it is, uh, please put a translation for that um, in the description below. I'm going for Finland anyways. I love the statue though. I, I really love this with the uh, valves and uh, oh well. Yeah, but this is Finland for me. Uh, maybe Norway though, um, but I guess it's somewhere in the north of Finland. Somewhere on a lonely road, maybe. Uh, maybe somewhere here? Oh, that looks looks alright. Love the landscape. Very, very rough, but uh, still moist, I guess. Not entirely in the middle of nowhere, fortunately. Um, as we found the house there. So, ah. Okay, another curve, so... <laughs> oh, I think there is another house. Uh, Verta, now you are up again. Ka Kazix Conti. Yeah, I think I still with Finland. Oh, we reached civilization. No! Okay, let's see then. Yep, I... Okay, that could have been a lot worse. Alright, 
Uh, I went with, uh, I was looking at the trees and looking at things, and I was thinking like something like Esto Estonia. Um, and uh, I decided to hedge my bets towards towards Central Europe, so I went with Lithuania at the end of it. And I got 22.15 as my score here. Pasta, how'd you do? Um, I did the sun thing right away, and because uh, it was far north, uh, it had to be far north, I uh, decided it had to be Scandinavia. I went down the road in one direction and found uh, two ways in with uh, some signage there, and that was definitely Finnish. So I went with Finland somewhere uh, near the west coast and got 2,702 points. Nice. We're not, we're not going to catch up to you at this point then. Uh, Fixer, how'd you do? Yep, I saw the, the Finnish signs and whatnot, and I guessed um, a little bit north in Finland and got 2520. Okay. Yeah, I, I was thinking fin Finland because of the two vowels in, in the name, like the two I's together. I was like, okay, that might be Finnish, but I wasn't too sure. I was going with I was going with Estonia, but I wasn't I wasn't confident about anything here. Um, Elzareth, how'd you do? I didn't find any signs with the language on it, unfortunately. Um, it I guess Sweden because it looked well Scandinavian. So I got twenty two seventy seven. All right. So final scores. Pasta's going to run away with it. I think I'll have well maybe the lowest score here. We'll find out. I had. 9,136 as my score here. There's one just glaring, that, that round four there, just glaring, standing out at me yep. with the poor score here. Uh, Fixer, how'd you do? 10,051. That damn South Africa killed me. Yep. And Elzareth? 9,148. And Again, the, score the, to, South the Africa score one. to beat. The score to beat, Pastafarian. It is 12,749. All right. So that is not the end of this, though. You guys can post your own scores in the subreddit and on the channels if you prefer, and we will take a look and see who we can crown the weekly champion. I don't know. This is a pretty pretty, pretty evenly matched one with a couple good yep. guesses. I think that they'll definitely run away with this, though, on the subreddit. So uh, we look forward to checking them out, and to tune in next week, Wednesday, for the scores. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.